doing this routine. And then one night I saw it on TV with a, a, a puppeteer and I, it was the same exact thing and I was really ticked. And so I stopped doing it all together and uh, my wife asked me tonight when we were on the way over here, she said, um, if the crowd is receptive, would you mind doing this? And I said, I don't wanna. <laughs> and she said, you'll do it or you'll sleep on the couch. <laughs> well, where we're staying, they don't have a couch, so I'm really worried. <laughs> But I'm gonna do this routine. I, allow me, I have to take off my jacket. And uh, it's, remember, it's not my shirt. <laughs> it's a borrowed shirt. It doesn't fit too bad, does it? Oh, no. But boy, is it sweaty. Whitley gets it back tonight. <laughs> to wring it out. Anyhow, allow me to set this up. Like I said, we didn't plan on doing this, forgive me. Um, and if you don't like it, it's my wife's fault. I got to turn my back on you, so just talk amongst yourself.
Somebody throw her ass out here. <laughs> Sing me some Elvis. You know, honey, we all need some Elvis, but he died. I <laughs> know. No. So all we've got left is you. All you've got left is me? That's a sad thing to say to anybody right now. <laughs> I will do an Elvis song, but uh, Elvis recorded lots of songs. And when he got out of the army around 1960, he went into the studio with his producer, Chet Atkins, in Nashville. And he decided to record this next song because it was requested by his manager, Colonel Parker. His wife had requested this song. So they put these really pretty blue and pink lights up in the studio to give a mood, you know. And when Elvis recorded this next song, he came out and he said to Chet, it was terrible. Don't release it. I don't do love songs very well. Wouldn't you like to have a dime for every love song he didn't do very well? Anyway, so I'm going to do this song, but what I'm going to do, and no offense to you over there, Little Miss Elvis fan, but I'm going to start doing with the Elvis version, then I'd like to do uh, my rendition of the song. It's a, it's a beautiful song from 1960 called Are You Lonesome Tonight? So. Oh. 